Hello. Hi, everyone. I have to tell you something. I found something great on the internet. In US, has Air played a reboot from the TV series called Charmed. Already in October 2018 it was broadcast. That's very interesting. A question for you. Have you ever seen Charmed earlier? Yes, I have. I watched every single season. A friend of mine, she borrowed the complete Charmed DVD collection. And finally I watched it till the end. What's Charmed about? It's about three young women who are sisters. And as they are the most powerful witches, they also have magical powers. The first ability is to influence objects with the power of thought. The telekinesis. That's right. The second ability is to stop time. In well. What do you mean? I think that from the first to the eighth season, the ability to let time stand still is not really true. But it's about molecules. There are two different ways. On the one hand, the molecules can be accelerated until the object explodes or the molecules slow down to motionless. Thank you. Yes, you're right. The third skill is take a look into the future or into the past. He three sisters receive these magical powers. But where does these magical powers come from? They come from their maternal Greek grand grandmother. Her name is Melinda Warren. She had once these three magical powers and has inherited them within the family line. Melinda Warren had also predicted that it's beyond belief. One day in the future, mighty three witches would appear. The world has never seen strong witches like they are. That sounds exciting. Yes, that's it. Who are the actresses of the first to third season of Charmed? The three actresses are... First we do have... Shannon Doherty. She plays the character of the eldest witch sister, called Prue. The second actor on this TV series called Charmed original show is the beautiful Alyssa Milano. She plays the character, called Phoebe. The third actor name is, let me think. Holly Marie Combs. She acts the part of Piper. The name, Holly Marie, is very interesting. Which mother has the idea to dub this name to her own child, Holy Mary? Holy Mary. Anyway, it's her own business. That's true. What happens at the end of the third season? The eldest of the witch sisters, Prue, She crashed deadly. In the fourth season, we see a new face. By actress, Rose McGowan. She acts the role of Paige. So that means that, the new charmed one are, Phoebe and Piper and the half-sisters Paige. Thanks for this overview. I've a question for you. I would like to know. What's the difference between Reboot and Remake? What's the diff? That's a naughty question. I've read comments on YouTube. There's an exchange about this topic, and it's discussed very hotly. Oh, dear. Generally, the word Reboot, no, don't mean, again boat. Reboot means something like restart. Let me explain. So let me show you an example I've seen on Netflix that there's an older TV series named Full House. Yes, right. The former actor's children are grown up and now they're telling their own story. That means that a reboot finds its origin with the end of the old series. 10 to 15 years later we'll begin the new series which ties in with the old story. A remake means something like redone. 
They're retaken some some elements of the old series, but the story is different in many ways. Anyway, it's structured differently. Just as an example, you probably know that from the remake movies of Batman. True. I have to tell you, I really want to watch this new charm trailer with you now. I was waiting a good while to sit with you here and watch this together. I have to look to the subtitles. Just a second. There re- Yes, there is one subtitle in English. It doesn't matter. You guys at home, you already know how we're dealing with the subtitle here. I have to check the subtitle again so I can read it more closely. I feel so lucky to be the mother of two special young women. Special in such different ways. Always remember that. You're better together. Your differences are your strengths. And nothing is stronger than your sisterhood. So nurture that. We are all over it. Yeah, we're gonna nurture it so hard. The light of the dawn has no meaning. You're lost in the hands of the night. Okay, I have to go. Something is wrong. <laughs> It's been three months and there's no evidence of foul play. Because you're not looking. Mel. Yeah, I know what's on the report. Are you serious? You're so angry all the time, Mel. This is why I don't come home. You're obsessed with mom's dad. Obsessed? Yes, obsessed. Because I'm not just moving on like nothing happened. That's not fair. I'm Maisie Vaughn. I think I'm your sister. If someone just showed up claiming to be your sister, would you believe them? Oh my god. What is happening? I'm fine on my own. I like being on my own. Then why'd you go there? I guess I wanted to ask him about my mom. If you try it again. Enough, okay? The hell? I'm drunk and clumsy. I, sh I should go. Isn't this the girl whose mom died? That should be nice. Is this some kind of, like, prank? <laughs> Ugh. I'm so bloated. The guy has some medication. Hello, ladies. What the? There is a reasonable explanation. <laughs> there we are. You are charmed ones. The most Powerful trio of witches. This is crazy. I am not a witch. I don't even like wearing witch costumes on Halloween. Like, not even slutty ones. I will help you understand it all. I am an advisor to witches. Wait, was Mom a witch? Bingo. And part of my speech. Your mother bound your powers when you each were born to protect you and let you live normal lives. She began the process of unbinding those powers the night she was murdered. I knew it. I knew she didn't fall. Your mother's spell book. The Book of Shadows. Your guide to protect the innocent and vanquished demons. You three have to decide whether you wish to accept your witchly fate. No, no way, I'm not doing this. Witchers aren't real. This is our legacy. Mom wanted us to do this and then we can figure out who killed her. Looks like something in the underworld knows you three had your powers activated. <laughs> Throughout history, strong women were called witches, and they are. We are. We have to the night. Maybe we can do this like once a month and never on Saturday night. Maggie! Okay, fine! Fine! I'm in. Timor, two spots in two days at a time. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have shut you out. And Macy, you're not alone anymore. We're sisters. You're better together. Your differences are your strengths, and nothing is stronger than your sisterhood. Always remember that. Charm, Sundays this fall on The CW. You have one's work cut out. 
Why thank you so much that you gritted your teeth. And you translated this subtitle in Austrian Sign Language. Amazing, I noticed how fast the subtitle was displayed. There's a lot going on. Despite mental hard work, you've earned a break. When we were filming the last episode, you had a plain and simple time because there was no subtitle you have to translate, but thank you for the compliment. Let's see who will translate the next video. Whoa if I will get bad luck again. Smooch. What, what did, did you I notice? notice? I recognized that. It is interesting that from the older Charmed series, I can see clearly the difference the old one and the new one. The first episodes of season 1 and season 4. They have processed the storyline in the first episode of the new version of Charmed, which can be seen in the old version of Charmed. That would be the first difference for me. This is also very interesting. The new version of Charmed has one different magical power. In the original there is the power of prophecy. And in the new one, they haven't it anymore. But before. There is the magical power to be able to read people's thoughts. That makes a difference to me as well. That's true. I have noticed that the three sisters have their roots from South America or Spain. The pretty half-sister Macy. She seems to have black roots. I think it's great that different people are shown on TV because that's the way our society is. I like that. Me too. It is interesting for me too. That the new storyline of Charmed. What all this will come to. In the older version of Charmed in the first season it's about to find the identity as a witch. In the second season it's about the witch life and the daily work in the human world. How do you deal with these two different worlds? The third season is about all about relationships. A witch, half witch, half human, has a relationship with magical partners. They do not have to hide their magical identities. They can act out their feelings and they feel like home in the magical world. They don't have to play hide and seek. In the fourth season it is about separations of relationships. The death of Prue is also processed. What is about their magical world now and what's next about the power of three? The separation of relationship is still topic in the fifth season. There are many magical fairy tales they will be told. The focus on the sixth season is Piper's son. His magical power is growing enormously, which should be tamed. The seventh season focuses on a utopian world. This means that neither good nor evil exist in the world. Life is very monotonous. In the eighth season and also the last season. It's about the ultimate power. That's the final battle. The rifles are drawn. No, of course not. The spells are drawn and conjured up. That's why I'm curious how the new version of Charmed and its own history will evolve over time. What I liked a lot to see the design of special effects. They adapted to the new conditions. Earlier in the older issue of Charmed, there are masks with other effort. But due to the improvement and expansion of the technology, this is a feast for the eyes. That's true. I'm also curious how the story will develop. To reiterate the topic reboot or remake. The debate about what the new version of Charmed is now. A reboot or a remake. I've a notion that the new Charmed series is a remake. I think so too. I already recognize a few details. 
which lets the story of charm go into different stories. I hope you enjoyed it today. Maybe you have a recommendation of a video for us. Send us the YouTube link and we'll have a look. Yes, that would be very good. Bye bye. See you guys. Bye.